Alright, and uh, as you can see, this was easy. Alright, so follow my uh, video tutorial from start to beginning. It's going to be a multiple parts, probably uploaded on YouTube. It's going to be uploaded at Morose Academy channel, and also I'm going to put it at KRASAV4IK82, my other um, channel that is mixed with some other stuff. But uh, please visit the youtube.com slash Morose Ac Academy uh, channel, which is going to be a um, very educational channel. I'm going to discuss a lot of IT topics, graphic designer topics, uh, developer topics. It's going to be a very educative channel. All right, and I found the ESUS Partition Master Home Edition is the best software out there for the partitioning. And it's a freeware as well. So search for it, Google it, and download it. This is a useful utility. Everybody needs to have it. All right, let me real quick, before we are done here, let me real quick show you how to resize the partitions. Let's say I would like to uh, get from this partition 50 gigabytes more to the Alex32. So I'm going to get from Alex400 gigabyte 50 partition, 50 gigabyte space to Alex32. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to click right click on it, resize and move, and I'm going to say make this 350 gigabytes. I'm going to click OK and it's just going to resize. All right. So now it's not Alex 400 gigabyte is not 450 gigabytes and I have unlocated free space which is not formatted yet. I have 50 gigabytes in here. So now I'm going to join this space to the Alex32, FAT32. I'm going to click resize and I'm going to say give me some more. Just give me all the way to 126 gigabytes. I'm going to click OK. It's going to take all that unlocated space on partition space and it's going to convert to the FAT32. And then I'm going to click apply. I'm going to click yes. There's the two operations. We just uh, took away 50 gigabytes from Alex 400, and the other operation we joined that 400 to, I mean, f 50 gigabytes to uh, 70 gigabytes to the Alex 32. All right, it's done. And now it's going to update it. And as you can see, I resized the partitions. So today, you just learn how to create, delete a format, and resize the partitions how to make the multiple partitions or disks with your external or internal hard drive. And this method will work on uh, Windows XP, Windows 2000, Windows 7, and Windows Vista operating systems, any bits version. And thank you so much for watching. My name is Alexander Moroz, and this little tutorial was presented and uh, designed for you by Alexander Moroz and Moroz Academy. Uh, my little project where um, I'm going to teach people uh, some skills and experience that I gained. So um, I also was recording this um, screen today with Moroz Video Capture program that I developed to capture the screen, uh, desktop screen, while you're doing your own video tutorials or to capture the gameplay while you're playing the games uh, under the Windows XP. Well, thank you so much. Please rate this video so more people can see it. Uh, subscribe if you like it. Bye bye now. Hello, guys, it's me again, Alexander Moroz, and I'm sorry about that. I just look like I need to add something to the video. Let me go ahead and check it. So, if you're gonna go my computer, just for some people who's not pretty familiar yet with the uh, disk partitioning and stuff. As you can see, I have the Alex 400 gigabyte. After the splitting, it's uh, 341 gigabyte of space because it took 50 gigabytes. And I have the Alex F32, which is 
F32 file system and it has 133 gigabytes and that's what I add and resize this partition so that's how you splitting one disk into the two disks or into the multiple disks you can split up to uh, five three four seven whatever you like and now let me go ahead and show you uh, how to how to create um, NTFS 500 gigabytes to a FAT32. I found this very um, hard topic over the internet, and nobody knows how to get NTFS back to the FAT32 um, one capacity over 200 gigabytes. All right, I'm gonna delete this partition for now. It's, it's gonna delete it, and it's gonna make this unlocated, unpartitioned, unformatted space. And now I'm going to join all the space to this hard drive to the LX400 gigabyte NTFS. And keep in mind that you can join the partitions, resize the partitions on one disk. You cannot resize partition from one hard drive uh, to partition from other external hard drive and mix them together or split their space between each. Uh, you you cannot do that so you can uh, split and resize multiple partitions on one external or internal drive you cannot split the partitions between the uh, two external or internal drives alright so you can partition splitting resizing on one disk using that one hard drive space alright now I'm gonna click right button and what I'm going to do, I'm going to resize all the way, take all that space to 500 gigabytes, almost 500 gigabytes. I'm going to click apply. So it's going to make my Alex 400 gigabyte up to almost 500 gigabytes. And I'm going to relabel it to 500 gigabytes. And now, wow, Google. Uh, my YouTube channel sent me some some stuff haha <laughs> my dear subscribers I love them I love the questions uh, I love to answer the questions all right as you can see I make it almost 500 gigabytes just because from the manufacturer this gigab uh, hard drive was less than 500 gigabyte even if it's rated to 500 gigabytes but it was less by about 20 uh, 21 gigabyte all right, as you can see, I have 500 gigabytes. Let me go ahead and click apply. So I'm just gonna take the changes. As you can see, I have the 500 gigabytes NTFS drive. Let me show you in my computer. Let's refresh it. I took the changes, and I have Alex 500 gigabyte drive in NTFS. All right. All right.